Did you know that I voiced in something recently? Little story time with Joey. Um, as you may or may not know, sometimes I like to do things other than creating videos and running a clothing brand. By the way, nonsense.jp, check it out. Because I am a person who tends to get bored easily. Or I guess a nicer way of saying it is I'm a person who has quite a large curiosity about a lot of things. I like trying out all sorts of different things, regardless of whether I think people think I am good at it or not. I always like to challenge myself with new things to see if I can become a better person. And one such thing that I've actually been doing for quite a while now is voice acting. Yes, your boy is a little bit of a, a, a Joe Dog VA. I mean, if you've seen Trash Taste, then you'll know uh, I love doing like voice impressions and stuff like that. And I've always kind of liked doing it ever since I was little. And that has somehow led me to do a couple of voice roles, uh, which my Wikipedia has listed out in a weird way. I also have an IMDB, did you know that? <laughs> but the newest addition to my voice acting role uh, actually happens to come out pretty soon as of me recording this video. You guys might have seen it, me uh, promoting it on my social media and stuff like that, but it is a little indie animation by a studio called Choc Chip Animation called The Art of Murder. So for those of you who don't know, Art of Murder is an up and coming indie animation project spearheaded by Australian animation uh, productions, Choc Chip Animation. I actually got to meet uh, the two founders of Choc Chip uh, back when I was in Sydney. When was this? Like, it was a really long time ago and it is now finally happening to come out. But essentially it's kind of like a pop culture parody murder mystery musical. It's the only way I can describe it. It's really cool, really unique. I have never really seen any kind of like animation, indie animation project that is like this. Um, and you know, as someone who is terminally online and uh, you know, loves to try out all sorts of new things, when they approach me to be like, hey Joey, uh, we heard that you're an okay voice actor you've you've you have voice acted in the past we have this character right here called sosuke who happens to be a parody of uh you can take a guess just from the look and the name of it and the whole shtick of this character is that he can only speak Japanese as he is supposed to be a parody or a personification of all anime characters and we heard that you're kind of Nihongo Jozu would you like to voice act as him? And I was like, well, sure, why not? I'm the anime man. I might as well put the anime in my title to good use. So again, apologies. I don't remember exactly which year this was. I believe it was like sometime. I don't even think it was that long ago, actually. I believe it was sometime during COVID. It was like 2022. 2021 something like that about three or four years ago if my memory serves me correctly uh i got to do a table read with the cast of the art of murder and the cast involved in this production was like pretty legit uh one that got me really surprised actually was uh the lovely lizzie freeman which for those of you who don't know voices pomni in the amazing digital circus and you know other notable voice actors like joey richter lauren lopez a bunch of really really talented like actual voice actors who like do this for a living and then meanwhile there's me sitting there at the table read being not a voice actor <laughs> so naturally doing this table read in front of all these actual professional talented voice actors got me really goddamn nervous but the one benefit that i had over everybody else at this table read is that i was going to do all of my lines in japanese which from my perspective made it so that I can kind of get away with being a mediocre voice actor. <laughs> I know it might sound like I'm giving myself too much shit with this case, but like, you have to understand that again, I'm at a table read of like four or five other actual professional voice actors. I am not a professional voice actor in the slightest. I just like voice acting, big difference. But regardless of that, we did this table read. I did my lines in Japanese and uh, the other voice actors gave me like a lot of like praise, which obviously, made me feel very good, gave me a lot of confidence. You know, when actual talented professional voice actors are like, hey, you're really good at voice acting, the ego does tend to get a bit inflated. <laughs> so we did this table read, we did these lines, and it turned out really, really good. I, I, I got my lines down, everybody sounded good, and I was really excited for it to come out. And then 
lo and behold, just a couple of weeks ago, the people at Choc Chip were like, Hey Joey, do you remember working with us? Uh, the pilot is finally coming out this year. So I guess without further ado, uh, let's check out the trailer for The Art of Murder. Uh, I have not seen this yet as of me recording this video, and I am very nervous to uh, hear myself, because I usually hate hearing myself voice act. So uh, here we go, it's two minutes long. Let's check it out. Someone in this room has murdered O.C. And I'm taking over this investigation. Wait, why are you investigating? Because I'm a detective. Ah! Oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. That was me. <laughs> Wow, I couldn't have sounded any more dejected. I mean, I guess it kind of works with the character of uh, Sosuke, but uh, God, just hearing myself. Oh, how do voice actors do it? How do, they, how do you guys hear your own roles? Because I absolutely hate it. Anyway, let's check out the rest of this animation. Or trailer. Oh, the music is so Look good too. This amazing dress. I mean, obviously, Kevin's it's a musical. such a talented artist. Oh, it's such a cute song. Wait, could it be? Pip has drawn another character? Honey soy sauce! A new character? <gasps> we haven't had one in ages! Welcome to the world of Pip's sketch book. I swear to god, every time I come on screen, every time I come on screen, I'm just like, ah! <laughs> it just wins. Bruh. Better not be that prosecutor in Ledgeworth. I do like how they're not afraid to like throw parodies around them. Any of those? No matter. Let me tell you all about your new life. Ooh. Just kidding. How could this have happened? So you're saying you just woke up like that? Look, we have to figure out who killed OC before 6 a.m. when Pip wakes up. Oh, God, I'm not going to be able to watch this pilot, bro. Featuring the voices of... Wait, why am I the first one? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> why am I... Why am I the first one in the lineup? I should not be the first one in the lineup, bro. Lauren Lopez. See, these people should be at the front, not me. Oh yeah, that's the one thing I was going to point out, actually. Um, these two lovely people here, Sonya and Giona, are actual composers for Netflix's One Piece live action and The Witcher series. So, um, you know, suffice it to say that they didn't pull any punches when it came to the music in this murder mystery musical. Uh, obviously the music has to be good, and these people fucking killed it, so... Shoutouts to Sonya and Giona for the great freaking music in that. Hell yeah. Also the animation just looks clean. Hell yeah. <laughs> Me with the sword. Welcome to the world. Welcome uh... to the world. November 14, 2024, which, if you guys uh, are seeing th the date of me uploading this video, it's already out. Um, it's over on the Choc Chip Animation website, or the YouTube channel, rather, which I will leave in the link in the description below. So go check out that pilot. Uh, I'm not going to play this pilot here because I want all them to get the views, obviously. So go give them some love and uh, check out me awkwardly voice acting. <laughs> I'm personally really looking forward to checking this out, um, and I hope you guys are as well. And again, a, a big thank you to the people at Choc Chip for giving me the opportunity to do something that is, again, very unique. Um, you know, I've done voice acting stuff before, like I've voice, you know, I've cameoed in like anime and games and you know that kind of stuff, but I've never done like any kind of musical number. And yes, I'm stressing the word musical because your boy does kind of sing in some parts. I, I'm not gonna say any further on that, so I'll, I'll just I'll just leave it up to the, the pilot. To be honest, I don't remember my lines. I recorded this like fucking three years ago, so sorry about that, but uh, I am looking forward to checking out the pilot for this, and uh, I'm sure it's gonna be great. I'm sure it's gonna be a lot of fun. Uh, a lot of people are hyped 
for this as well, which is makes me really happy as well, especially. And uh, obviously, yeah, shout out to Chockchip for letting me do this and uh, hopefully uh, we can do multiple episodes of this because I think it'd be a really fun project. But yeah, I think overall, uh, regardless of how people feel about my performance of this, um, I really enjoyed this, uh, you know, doing like, again, a proper table read with professional voice actors, just challenging myself to do something different and unique. Um, you know, it was just like, it, it made me realize like, yeah, I, I love doing this kind of stuff. I love just like trying it out, you know, trying to improve, trying to get better at whatever it might possibly be. So yeah, I'm, I'm really looking forward to this and, uh, I guess I will leave it at that. But yeah, thanks for watching guys. Um, again, if you want to check out the trailer to this, I will leave it down in the description below and thanks for watching. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to smack my face right here, subscribe to the channel. Let's keep making big channel number go bigger over here next to my head. A couple more videos you can check out if you enjoyed this one, links to my social media as well as my Patreon to support me directly and nonsense, my clothing brand, nonsense.jp. Check it out, links in the description. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.